Scoots back in a long drive. Look at me. I'm standing right here on a road waiting for things to happen. I heard a, ra- I heard a rabbit die, and it got me a little nervous because <laughs> he just died out of nowhere. I don't like it when they do that. So you know the drill. What's this? Oh, yeah, I drove through there last time. It was real scary. Uh, <laughs> 50 kilometers or more in the long drive. Um, I noticed. Oh, yeah, here it is. I think I nearly have one of everything in the game, except for magazines and certain car parts I don't need. Um, there we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drive in a second. I just want to reset my odometer. So, according to the numbers, and I'm gonna show you this to prove my point. So, if I hit escape, and I go to save and load, and I go all the way down to the bottom of my save list, because there's a lot of them here, and I go to here... I've driven 10,165 kilometers, Uh, and that was the last save before I I got to this point, before I loaded the game, so I've gotten in my truck since then, but we're we're over the mark. I'm not sure how much is left, but we're gonna see, but you know the drill. What, scream, rabbits, I'm busy. You know the drill, 50 kilometers or more with the sexy cowboy. Oh, Jesus, know what we need? Karen, you're right down there, baby. <laughs> Just hope you're all right. Okay, we're going to go down the road with all my trailers. And we're going to do 50 kilometers as per the use. Unless we run out of road, obviously. But we're getting there. How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing well. Once again, big shout out to all the uh, the fans that show up every day. Um, Because you guys are you guys are what make the channel. And another shout out to Jacob Bomarito for making this entire trip possible. I never would have done it without him. So, shout out to Jacob B. Thank you so much for uh, pushing me forward in the early days. But here we are. We're we're on our way. Um, Now, I don't know what's going to happen when we get to the end. To be honest, because they've updated the game two or three times majorly since I started this journey. So I don't even know if the starting house will be there, but I guess we'll uh, we'll find out when we find the end of the road. Because that's just the way the game works. <laughs> but if my mom's not there, and there's no reservations at the Olive Garden, I'm going to be right upset. I'll tell you that right now. I didn't come all this way to not have Olive Garden at this point. <laughs> Where's my road lotion? We still got it. Sometimes it falls off. We got two Karens. We got road lotion. I should probably get the other Karen some legs, too, at some point, I think, but what's that out there? There's something over there. What is that? Let's go take a boo. Okay, there we go. Is is that a house? That might be a house. Let's check it out. We never know. It doesn't hurt to go see what's going on once in a while. All right gonna be a good day i can feel it hopefully my trailers don't have any spaz situations going on people keep pointing out stuff like you know the fifth trailer on the right side it's got stuff it's gone too far at this point there's too many trailers for me to check them all with any sort of sense of time oh there's a good song for you by the inbreds any sense of time go look that up it was featured in a trailer park boys episode it's from the 90s canadian band real good Okay, let's see here. All right. Gonna go. Okay, we're slowing down. Whoop! We're slow. Well, okay, we're slow. Okay, we're slowing down. We are slowing down. Okay, here we are. Let's see. What do we got going on here? We've got a, we got a bike. we got something else on the roof. Basket on the roof. I like the grass. It makes the rabbits scary. we got a car. You know what I need, actually? Uh, ignition off. All right, what we need is a sun visor. Because I remembered I was missing a sun visor. Because it fell off during an accident. And I don't know what happened to it. It's gone. Auto save. All right. It was, which one was it? Was it the driver's side? No, passenger side one. So let's grab this one. And then we can put this. Ah. Now, someone asked me in the comments, I should said I should probably leave my Not-A-Snake in... Okay. 
uh, in the car, so I have two hands. The problem is, is the Nana Snake is very strange in the physics department. So it falls through stuff very easily and partially falls through stuff and you lose it quite easily. So I probably wouldn't do that. But I could always leave my extra gun magazine laying around. It doesn't seem to clip as easy. And I shouldn't need more than an entire magazine worth of ammunition if I decided I needed it. What? Sometimes the door slam doesn't work. Why is that? That'd be nice to know. Okay. Let's see, back out here. Okay, this is what we needed. We got We got our sun visor now. There we go. You know, in real life, I've never used those. I'm a tall guy. I've never needed them. And I sit very straight. So I've never needed the sun visors in a car before. I've never used them. I just find them annoying that they're there, <laughs> to be quite honest. Okay, let's see here. Uh-oh. Um, road? Where? I came around that side of it, so the road's got to be over here somewhere. Road! I know, there you are, Road, I can see. Rabbit, stop screaming at me, I'm busy! I, you're always screaming like I owe you money or something, and I don't owe you nothing. Okay, here we go. We're gonna go back to the road and keep on heading, up, keep on keeping on, I guess, with our convoy. Oh, the Love Cowboy's having a good day. You know, it's all sultry and good. Sometimes him and Karen go on dates, you guys don't see it. But, uh,. I, I, you know, you got to leave people's personal lives out of games. But, yeah, sometimes they go on dates when we stop at the uh, the diners. Which I call Canadian Tire, but, you know, you know how it is. Got to represent. <laughs> what sucks is Canadian Tire is actually really terrible for car parts. They never have anything you're looking for. And the worst part is, a lot of times when, I'm, when I've worked on cars... I'll use parts from another car on that car. So if I'm not building a, uh, like a restoration, if I'm just doing like a resto mod or something, like you'll take like, oh, I'll use the uh, the master cylinder off of like a, an S10 or something on like a Ford, right? Cause it just, it, cause you want it for certain, or something like that. So you go in there, but they specifically say to you like, what year and make of the car is it? And you'll say, oh, I just need the master cylinder off of this year. And they're like, well, you know, we, we need to know so we can tell you. And so you gotta lie to them in order to get the right part. <laughs> like, like it's just it's it's stupid. Trailer, stop it. We don't need a re rehash of what happened last time. I'm just gonna stay on the edge of the road or as far over as I can, so I don't catch those uh, telephone poles or electrical poles or whatever poles these are. There we go. See, so yeah, season three, I've been milling over some ideas. I'm pretty sure at this point. I'm going to do a couple multiplayer episodes just to showcase that for fun. Oh, God. And then uh, season three will be a surprise for sure. I would love to do a multiplayer 5,000 kilometer drive. But I'm not sure I know anybody who would do it for that long with me. Okay, stop. Nice. All right. Let's, uh, let's check this. How far have we gone? Only seven. And we've already made two stops. That's that's pretty decent. Hmm, this this tire is having a having a moment. There we go for the next guy. Okay, let's just back up this trailer so we can open these doors. See you around, bud. Don't get lost. All right, this is very just. Uh, someone's already raided this. Uh, autos, hey. It saves so waterly all the time. Okay. Yeah, there's not a lot going on in here. You know, people have commented on several occasions how I'm missing the light on the other side of my truck. Um, that was intentional. That I no longer have that light on the, on the side of my truck because I needed the space for other things. Um, like this side. I want to put the TV there. So what we'll do for those people that are very concerned about me not having side lighting is there. <laughs> does, that, does that help you out, guys? Is this better? Am I your performing monkey? No. <laughs> yeah, so now there we go. We got a light on this side too. It's not even. So maybe we can find another basket. We can put it evenly on this side somewhat and uh, do that. All right, let's go here. Okay. I considered putting one on the roof uh, with forward-facing lights, but honestly, the headlights are so good, I don't think you would actually need them. 
like the headlights are freaking amazing in this game so you don't you don't need like like if you put them on the bright setting they just go forever but with the baskets and there is some there people are right about that with the baskets you could put lighting uh literally surrounding your vehicle if you set them up right like you could angle all the lights to get literally a circle of light around your vehicle and it would work a treat now the one thing i've never tested is can you attach uh baskets to trailers i guess which is something i would actually like to know i think it'd be kind of fun to find out is that a double building is that what that is rabbit get off the road rabbit don't do it bud jeez yeah like these lights are incredible oh there's a pile of junk here look at all that well none of it i need i guess rabbits are crossing the road everywhere stop it all right, let's, uh, I, we should probably sleep. We're getting on to nighttime. Um, I think this may be the moment. We may have, may have our moment. The road is banking to the left. And it goes pretty straight for a little while. All right, let's, uh, get around the bend here. All right, let's, uh. Yeah, and then it goes straight for a bit. Excellent. Okay, here we go. We're going to try this. I'm not promising anything. We're going to see how this goes. <laughs> Get ready for it, people. Get ready for it, if it's even possible at this stage. All right, let's see. we got to get around the bend. All right, we're getting around the bend now. Okay. Now, this doesn't always work out, but we're going to give it a shot. Okay, we're around the bend, and we're lined up, I think, and sleep driving, sleep driving, banana, sleep driving, going too fast, gonna hit a rock, sleep driving, banana, whoop, the road's over here, <laughs> oh, rock, 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 oh, oh, are we okay, whoop, nope, we're not okay, hold on, trailers, hold on, get back on your wheels, bud. Okay, we're okay, okay, okay. It's all over the place. Oh god, okay, we're on our wheels, we're fine. Okay. Okay, whoa, 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 oh, oh boy! Oh god! Oh, oh, okay. I think we're alright, let's go. Oh wait a minute, Karen's on the road back there. No trailers, don't follow me like this. This is wrong. Circle the wagons! <laughs> Circle the wagons! All right. You know what? Not bad. Not bad. All right. Well, this will be okay in a second. Um, all right. Let's... Uh, now, trailers, I don't need you attacking me. Oh, we, we lost another thing. Wait a minute. That's the original one. It must have been inside the car somewhere. All right, Karen, sit there. Ready? We got to go straighten out our trailers. Let's do this. There we go. Come on. Trailers need to be straightened out. Come on, guys. Do your thing. Okay, we're getting closer to straight trailers. Okay, okay. Oh, look out. Cactus. Cactus. Now, the problem is... I'm the creator of my own folly here. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Definitely enjoy this. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Oof. Okay. Back on the wheels. There we go. Okay. Nope. Nope. We're, we're fine now. Just relax. Okay. We're kind of, we're kind of stuck here, boys. Um... Boys? Okay, it's just squealing away? All right. <laughs> Let's try that. We're going to put the parking brake on on this. 
We'll see if we can disconnect. Get this thing to move a little forward. There we go. Okay, perfect. All right, now we'll back it up. Get back in here, jump out, see if we can't reattach, and see if those, those trailers will uh, correct themselves to some degree. All right, moving on. Oh, yeah, that trailer's still hooked up. Hang on. I forgot to turn off the uh, parking brake. The trailer brakes. There we go. Okay, I always forget to do that. There we are. All right. Now, eventually, those things usually work themselves out. So, we'll see how that goes. All right. There we go. Come on. You guys are starting to correct yourselves. There you are. There you are. Perfect. Look at that. Who says I don't know what I'm doing? I had a guy in the comments once tell me I have no idea how to play this game. Are you, are you going to be a problem, Rabbit? Because I, I really don't need the shit right now. Um, all right. Let's just jump out here. Where are you, Rabbit? I saw you. Did he dis, dis, there he is. No. No auto save right now, please. If he gets angry, he'll be over here before I come back. Come on. Ooh, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm, I, you know what? I'm a little nervous. And, uh... That means you die. No, I said you die. There you go. Okay. Now, normally I won't just kill random rabbits for fear of repercussions. That's oil. But today we need to make kilometers. Ah. What are you? You're oil as well. I haven't seen much diesel lately, but I, I don't even need it. You're empty. You're empty. We got a metal bar. Was this a metal bar? Is this what this is? Yep, just a metal bar. Just really rusty. Um, yeah, not much going on here. Is this oil here? That's empty as well. All these are empty? That's weird. Don't usually run into too many empty ones. All right, let's, is this a bucket? Uh, that's just a bucket. All right, well, not much going on. Let's, uh, oh, yes, there is something going on. I saw you. I, I know, I totally forgot about this. Okay, door, don't do this. Okay, we just need you to get, oh, there we go. Okay, nope, come on, come on. Uh, my steam, someone's trying to get a hold of me on my steam. I apologize. Ah, don't go too far. We need you. Uh, there's a foot up here. Boy, somebody uh, had a rough day. <laughs> there we go, do that. And, oh, oh, here we go. And do this. Nope, we need you down there a little bit. Okay, and then uh, get in here. All right. Uh, no problem. All righty. Oh, it got stuck. I see how it is. Okay. Uh, nope, no, get out of here. We don't need you anymore. Get out. Nope, don't need you. Don't, okay, stop taking parts off the car, fool. Come on, come on. There you go. <laughs> All right. Whoa, it's like art. Okay. Not cool. Not cool. Okay. Okay. Now we just got to get all these on. Okay. Here we go. Pick this up. There we go. Okay, you know what? In these accidents, I'm going to start losing these, and then I won't have enough hubcaps ever. Like, constantly, I'll be shamed for not having hubcaps. It's a real problem. Hashtag stop hubcap shame. All right, here we go. And this can go on here. So we still need a total of what? Four, six. Unless I lost some on the other side, but we'll check that at the next stop. Okay. This is going well. Okay. Now, normally my Steam notifications are turned off, but I don't know why that one made that noise. It normally doesn't do that, but I guess we'll find out why they're not making, they're just still making noise. I got rid of the pop-ups because every once in a while I'd be playing and someone would message me. And I don't know that many people on Steam, but I do get uh, the odd one that pops up. But that's all right. Rabbit, get out of the way, bud. We're coming through. So we got to be real careful of what those trailers are doing because whenever they get hit in a post like this or a big rock, they start having problems. So we just got to just gotta snake it along. No issues. 
You know, as someone was telling me Komodo, Komodo Gaming uh, struggles with one trailer and I got like five. He told him to come on over. I'll teach him how to do it. We'll do a collab. We'll teach him how to drive with a trailer um, and how intense that can be most of the time. And we'll, we'll see how that goes. Because you know what? I could get on board with him and OB. I'd play with them. They sound like fun guys. Okay. No, actually, you know what? I'm a tiny little channel and he's a big dude. So I would not uh, not do that to him. I would not ruin his channel by hanging out with Komodo Gaming. <laughs> but I am willing to give him advice. That I'll do. And he doesn't have to sell him it was me, but I'll teach him how to handle the multiple trailer train. I'm getting kind of used to it. Oh, right. So yeah, someone get old Komodo and say, yo, man, we'll multiplayer this. I'll show you how it's done. I won't record it, I promise. We'll get it done. Teach you the ins and outs of... Uh, trailer etiquette like right now see I'm not driving on the road but I'm close to the road because I don't want to catch on those poles if it decides to go nuts but because of that I got to be extra aware of rocks because the grass hides them the last thing we need is a whole bunch of hidden rocks Whoa, okay there we go see now that's gonna whip the trailer see so we got to stay far enough away so if they do whip hard we don't hit any stationary objects. At least that's my plan. I'm not sure well it's going to work out, but I guess we'll find out. Come on, baby. Haul some ass. Oh, we're doing over 100. This isn't bad at all. There we go. I'd love to find a couple more trailers before the end of this, but I'm not sure that's going to happen. We're in very, very early game uh, generation, so Lord knows what we're going to run into. Okay, so here's a big rock, so we want to go around that. Somewhat. Easy going. Easy does it. Oh, the love cowboy's having a good day. He's having a good day. You know, I never thought when I started a YouTube channel I'd actually develop my own characters. That was never my plan. But it makes me wonder, where else can we take the love cowboy after this? I should get that uh, cowboy simulator game and create the love cowboy in there that could be fun I could see that being a good time I wanted to play that ranch simulator but I only wanted to play it multiplayer and I haven't been able to convince anybody to play with me <laughs> that looks hilarious all right come on even books won't play it Ooh. but she is a massive fan of snow runner we've been playing that we stream that about once or twice a week over on the Discord. So if you want to come see uh, me and Books attempt SnowRunner terribly, because uh, we're both not very good at it, you should pop over. We have a good time over there. We attempted to do a mission the other night, and uh, after two hours and 45 minutes, we managed to complete a mission and gain 400 experience or something. <laughs> but we did complete it. She's as tenacious as I am. Oh, here we go, rocks. See, I get pissed off when we're not doing stuff right. I'm like, God damn it, what the hell's going on? But not her. She's just all in it for the for the laughs. Uh, I'm trying to be more like her personality. Because she's uh, she's always, no matter what happens, she's always just thinks it's funny. So, well, so do I most of the time. But when you got two hours into something and you roll your truck at the very end, yeah. Because someone won't drive to a tree. Yeah, Books, I'm bringing it up. Deal with it. Told you to drive to the tree, Books. Yeah, here we go. This is kind of like half desert. It's a little green here. What? Why won't it turn? Turn, please. There we go. Oh, God, what happened? What happened? What did we hit? What did we hit? Okay, just relax, relax, relax. Get away from the big rock. It'll pull straight. It'll pull straight. There you go. Perfect. All right, we're good. Excellent. I'm not sure what happened there, but something did. Oh, we got a gas station. Maybe there's some a uh, little bit of diesel here or something. How are we doing for that anyway? We're burning through a quarter tank. I should probably fill that up, I'm assuming. Yeah, let's fill up the tank while we're here. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any diesel here, but we should probably check the oil. What's the oil doing? Ah, nine liters. We're not bad, but we'll see if there's any oil kicking around. All right, let's see here. Now, I have my... Ooh, okay, there it is. There it is. 
causing problems. Uh, auto saving, big time. Okay, let's see here. We got oh, this has got gas in it, which we don't really need. Oh God, what am I doing? I should have, you know what? Come here, TV. <laughs> okay, that was just gonna lend itself to some problems if I did uh, try to pull that by. So let's open this up. We'll dump this out, or we'll drink it. That's cool too. Um, there we go. And then, uh, okay. Got to get this up to the spout here, I think. Let's see. It's, uh, can we turn the spout on here just a little bit just so I can see it coming out? Is this going? No, it's not going in there. Oh, yeah, it's going in now. There we go. Let's just jack it wide open and see what happens. There we are. Perfect. We're probably losing some diesel, but... That's all right. All right, let's wind her down here. And 18991234567. Ah, that's good enough. All right. Pick this up here. All right. Open this up and we'll put that in there. Oh, I can actually use more looking at it. We got a ton of diesel, so it's not like we're going to run out anytime soon. Every one of those trailers has some diesel in it, so... I could have fit it all in one trailer, but what fun would that have been? Okay. We need about, what, another 15? Yeah, about 15 more, so... Uh. All right, let's uh, do it again here. Let's line it up here. All right, let's turn this on. I don't think that's going in it, but we'll just... Is that not open? Did I close it? That would be why, maybe? Oh, oh, we're auto-saving. Just spilling diesel all over the desert. We're going to cause a fire. <laughs> Stop. Is that? Okay, that's closed. That's open. All right, let's move this a little here. Is that right? No, I can't tell if that's open or not. I think that's open. Yeah, it's kind of open. All right, let's do it. There we go. Now it's going in. The trailer's moving. That's why. There we go. Okay. Trailer was just moving. It was rolling along here. Perfect. Okay. Just fill this up a little bit. Let me go faster than that. What do we need? Like 15.7? Yeah, something like that. Okay. Turn it off. 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 Okay. What do we got now? 15.4. That'll get us close. We're not looking for perfection. We're not that kind of guy. All right. Put it in here. I should just fill one up and leave it there just so it's always ready to go, but I'm never that low where it's an emergency need. There we go. All right. Let's put this, you know, I might need daylight to put this on properly. Yeah, let's get some daylight here. Hang on. Let's fall asleep here in the open. Hopefully no rabbits come and eat my face. What was that? What was, oh, so it was the light on the trucks from the moon. All right, let's, uh, let's do this up. All right, let's just, uh. Rotate this around some. Okay, I'll put this in the back. Like that. And then we can put our TV back on. I plan to have a TV when I get home. It's a luxury item out here in the wasteland. Okay, I think that'll lock itself in. All right, we can turn this brake off too. There we go. Okay, I got to close the gas cap. Gas cap. All right, come on. That's enough. Auto saving. Okay. Put that on. And I think there may be some oil or gas. This is usually gas at these stations, but yeah. Oh, another love cowboy hat. I can't tell you how much that means to me. Oh, the love cowboy doing his thing. All right. Well, there's not much going on here, but we do need to get a little bit of oil. I do have a giant tank of oil. I'm just trying to avoid 
having to pull it off and dragging it into the cab of my truck and all that stupid crap. So hopefully we can uh, just find a little bit of oil. Like if it needed, I can grab it. It's not a big deal. What you really should carry, if you want to carry extra oil, I just find it usually and don't worry about it. But if you want to carry it, the big barrel is not worth it. You'd be smarter carrying like a jerry can full of oil. That way it's easier to move around and store. And it doesn't burn that much oil. So like none of the engines burn a ton of oil. I'm, I'm usually putting oil in my engines. Uh-oh. <laughs> about once every two or three episodes. So sometimes I'll top it off, but you don't need to really worry about it. It's not super, uh, super necessary. As long as you're not down, like, I've ran it down two and two liters, two and a half liters in the normal engines, and it's not caused me a problem yet. So, but usually if I get about a half a liter, I'll, I'll look for oil and fill it up because, you know, why not, right? You got to keep a die on your engines, you know, just make sure you got good oil in there. Speaking of which, I think my car needs an oil change. Does it? Mm, I don't remember. I have to check. But so far, this has been going great. We're not having too many problems. We've had the odd hiccup, but nothing super serious. It's the way we like it. Got our trailer brake off this time instead of trying to drag around with the trailer brake on, which was pretty funny, but not necessary. <laughs> oh, there we go. Come on, baby. Watch out. Okay, every time it's hit a cactus or something, the trailers go nuts. That's why we need another one. I feel like if an, another trailer would help balance out the whole thing. Wouldn't have as many problems. Maybe two more trailers. That'd be cool. Oh, a little rock right here. Something out there. Oh, it's a big gas station. I do like exploring those. Oh, let's go take a peek. It's a little off the beaten path. Normally I wouldn't go this far out of my way, but being we're getting closer to the end, I kind of want to collect uh, a couple more trailers if I can. But this one isn't too far off the beaten path. There we go. God, what, is it on a rock? What is going on there? Start breaking now because this thing does not slow down. Oh, what is this? Just a car. Let's see what's going on in here today. We got a tank here. What's this? Empty. Now you can carry around an empty one of these and put stuff in it, but I keep telling people, and I don't think anybody believes me when I say it, but uh, you don't really need to bring gas. Like you're going to find gas everywhere. Like there's gas. Oh, there's some oil. There we take this. Yeah, but like it's really unnecessary completely. You're just carrying extra stuff for no reason. Now, if you got a good tanker truck or something, then yeah, grab it. Why not? Let's see here. Pick you up and dump you in there. Nice. Okay, let's get rid of you. We don't need you anymore. Get out of here. Close you up. There we go. Oil's filled back up. That solves the oil problem, but we do have more hubcaps here, which is nice. All right. Uh, where is that going to land? All right, well, we'll throw them over there and see if we can't find them. <laughs> Meow. Meow. Okay, got it. And we'll throw this one kind of over there. Uh, that way I'm not running back and forth. And yaw. Well, I probably need to throw the last one, but we did. It is what it is. I'm seeing some hubcaps, so we're not, we didn't lose them all. Nice. Okay, let's grab this. Jeez, we are hubcapless everywhere. Put this one here. Put that one. Oh no, what happened to it? Where'd it go? Oh, it's under the wheel now. Oh no. Got it. Okay. You can go there. You can go there. And now we only need two more, which is awesome. And then we just got to polish them up and everything's got hubcaps. Jeez. This is, this is a real chore collecting this many hubcaps, let me tell you. Oh, God. Why is there always a board laying in front of the door? Hup. Oh, we got another magazine here. 
got 25 rounds in it. There's another magazine here. It's got 16 rounds in it. Jeez. We got bike tires. We got, looks like a license plate. I think one of my trailers doesn't have a license plate. Now that I'm thinking about it. I should probably check that. All right, let's check. Because there are several plates around here from the other cars, so. And there's a couple in here. Draftney, how's it going? <sighs> Coily and Loggington have been so easygoing. Now that I have them locked down, it's almost not fun. <laughs> you got a plate. You got a plate. Do you have a plate? You do not have a plate. Bam. Now you're plated. We're all legal again. Let's get out of this joint. I should really check for uh, sponges and stuff or uh, scrapers. What are, those, what are those things called? Brushes. But we're not gonna. Moving on. Let's get out of here. How far have we gone? 26. Not bad. That's the halfway point of this of this particular journey. See, I like this game still a lot. Like I was actually on the long drive um, Steam discussion. I accidentally clicked on it when I was doing some other things. Boy, the amount of people complaining about how you can't get to the end of the road now it's impossible with all the glitches. I would beg to differ. <laughs> if you got some tenacity and can problem solve, yeah, you can make it pretty easily. Now, not everybody likes every game, and that's fine. I, I get that. But to say straight up it can't be done when it's obvious it can, just, uh, you're just kidding yourself because you're mad. There we go. Yeah, the one guy was talking about how My Summer Car is a much better game. My Summer Car is also a very different game. So, like, My Summer Car couldn't do something on this scale. Although it would be awesome if it could. You could combine Infinite Generation with the My Summer Car car. Jeez, that would be hilarious. Wearing out parts, having to fix your car on the side of the road, losing your toolbox, having to walk. My summer uh, road trip. Yeah. So we got another gas station here. Been a lot of stops today. Like I said, I'm just I'm just checking a lot of stops recently to see what uh, what may have changed in the early generation of the game. Because I remember it being very like the spots being very messy. Like, and having so many things laying around, but it seems they've corrected that problem. And there's a lot more of these mountains recently, too, I've noticed. All right. I'm not sure we're going to be able to stop for this one. Not much going on there anyway, so forget it. Let's just keep going. All right. Got to keep the party rolling. Love, cowboy. All right. God, I need a TV show with this guy. That'd be the whole gist of the show. He just drives down a road, meets new people along the way. There used to be a show called The Littlest Hobo. And it was about this dog that... I think it was only on Canadian television, but it was about this dog that was, like, super, super smart, and he went around helping people. And each episode, he would, like, you know, stop a crime or help some family or something like this. Then he'd go on his way. And I still remember the theme song for it. And I'm thinking, that'd be a great great thing for the love cowboy to do just goes town to town spreading love and helping people like touched by an angel but tolerable to watch yes that could be a fun one i would watch that show the love cowboy coming this winter on fox okay what do we got here this is a double building we hate those like with a with a, fl a flaming and fiery passion Yes, double buildings are nothing but trouble. And you, you just want to avoid them at all costs. This is when the comment section lights up. But I go to them all the time. They're fine. Nope. They tried to kill me once. And I have since forgive, never forgiven them. And they'll just have to live with it. The Love Cowboy is a forgiving man. But he's not that forgiving. You only have to try to kill him a couple of times. And he gets right upset with you. Just the way things are. But I hope you guys are doing super well today. You know, it's, it's a nice day. It was a nice, beautiful day outside. Nice. I, I used my smoker today. Did some uh, did some pork on the smoker. It was a good day. Well, I didn't. Books actually did it. I guess she felt like cooking. Which is rare for books, so we got to encourage it. 
What do we got coming up here? What is this? What is this building? Is this a house? Is this my house? Is this the end of the road, maybe? I don't know what that is, but it doesn't look super familiar. Oh, gas station, maybe? Maybe. It's hard to tell. 33 kilometers into this. Yeah, it looks like a gas station. Let's check it out. I'll start braking now because otherwise you'll never stop. When you get, if you watch it when it gets under 80, the brakes start working really well. Watch. Get under 80. And then they'll start working like a dream. But anything over 80, they won't work. Well, they do work. They just don't work great. All right, ignition off. Let's see what's going on here. Sorry about all the stops today. I'm just having a uh, having a good day. When I have good days, I like to stop and see what's up. We got gasoline. Okay, we must have found 30 liters of gas so far on this trip today. Nothing down there. Oh. Uh oh, auto save. Ooh. All right, nothing, nothing much going on. Anything on the roof? There used to be stuff on the roofs all the time. Now there's nothing. Hardly ever, anyway. Let's go, truck. Come on, baby. Time for a little swig for my drink here. Oh, yes. The road calls. Now, the acceleration is definitely down with all these trailers, but it'll get up and go eventually. Ah, oh, yes. Perfect. Back on the road. You know, it's funny. I remember doing episodes sometimes in like 25 minutes, 30 minutes, when I would just hurry through it if I was in a rush. I couldn't do that now with these trailers if I wanted to. It takes so long to accelerate. And then you barely get up there, and then it's like, oh, there's another place to stop. <laughs> what do we have here? I don't see anything going on. Huh. Actually, hang on one second. I have to use the bathroom suddenly, and uh, I can't do, I can't sleep, sleep pee. Give me one second, I'll be right back. And we're back. Sorry about that. All right. Yes, when nature calls, you know how it is. All right. Perfect. How far do we got to go? 15K? That's not bad. Oh, I feel much less stressed now. I can tell you that. Sometimes it sneaks up on you, man. Okay. Didn't have to go when I started. Had to go now. <sighs> That's better. Okay. Feeling good about my decision. It's getting a little tense. So we still got all our trailers. Everything's going pretty good today, actually. We're hitting 80. I like how it just crawls up to speed. That's good, though. We like this. We like things working out this way. Oh, it's turning nighttime. Jeez, the delays today have been ridiculous. What was that? I saw something shine on the horizon over there. Okay, trailers, relax, please. I don't have time for you to be getting caught around another telephone pole. Oh, there it is. Okay, come on. Okay, we need to go around this rock. Perfect. Okay, oh, look out. There's a little rock. Little rocks don't seem to matter as much. Excellent. This is going so well. Is that something in the distance? No, no, nothing yet. We're getting so close to the end, I'm getting nervous. I don't know how I'm going to react when I get there. Oh, yeah, it's going to be a thing. It's going to be a thing. I'm trying to be positive about the whole thing, but I'm kind of sad to see it go. This is a lot of my identity wrapped up in this. A lot of my stories, a lot of my personality. To see it all end is going to be, uh, going to be a rough one. I can set myself some challenges for season three. But I definitely want to check out the multiplayer. I heard it's buggy as hell, which makes me want to do it even more because I like it when things are hilariously buggy. 
Oh, go, oh rabbit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Hold on, we gotta get away from those poles. Yeah, oh god, why is there so many things sticking out of the ground right now? Jesus! Screw this! Oh, I can't sleep yet. All right. All right. Sleep driving, sleep driving, ba -da -da. sleep driving, sleep driving, looking for a rock to hit. Here it comes. We're good. Okay. Yeah, someone said they were at work the other day and were like, yeah, I couldn't get the sleep driving song out of my head. I know this is a weird song people seem to like. People really ask me to people really ask me to do it a lot. Sleep drive in, sleep drive in. Ba -da -da. That worked out well actually, that sleep drive. <laughs> See eventually, like so far, I think my worst one was I bumped a rock very softly. But one day your luck's gonna run out, right? Like you're gonna hit a rock or whatever. The road's never usually straight enough for a long sleep drive. And that's only if you get perfectly lined up anyway. If you don't get perfectly lined up or the road changes out with like elevations, you can go flying off that road real quick. I don't recommend sleep driving at all. It's not it's not smart. Uh, in real life or in a video game. <laughs> oh. Something happened. What was that? The game just went all weird for a second. Okay, there we go. We're good. We're still good. We're still good. It's still good. Everything's cool, SA. We got this going on. You know what I've not seen in a while? Any sort of hill. It's been a long time since I've seen a hill. Now I see something out here I want to go. Oh God. Don't, don't hit the pole. Okay. What is that? Looks like a garage. I'm going to go check that out because that looks like fun. Looks like uh, one of the bigger uh, garages there. Yeah, I think it might be that or uh, a bunker. But oh, we're getting closer to it. Yeah, it's hard to tell. I think it might it might be one of the big garages. Now this is where people make the argument I should bring the binoculars, which I do have a pair. But you don't really need them. You can just kind of zoom into the distance. Yeah, it's looking like a big garage. Let's go around this tree. Watch over that rock a little bit. Perfect. Okay. This is just, this has been a relaxing episode and I'm enjoying it. I'm super tired today, so this works out. And I got to go to work still. I didn't get much sleep last night and I'm just kind of burned out here. Okay. Oh, no, it's a bunker. Brakes on. All the brakes. All the brakes. Okay, we're going to have to shoot around it. Shooting around. Shooting around. And stop. Okay. Let's take a little look here. Let's take a little look. See. Um, jumping out. Okay. Let's see. Did we get all the hubcaps we needed now? We did not. So this was. Ooh, auto save. Uh, 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 uh. There we go. Oh, I just, did I just, it looks like I just kicked the car. <laughs> Let's throw that like this. Slide closer. All right. And we'll take you. Perfect. We'll walk this one around. Now we have hubcaps on every wheel as far as I know. Let's check them all out just to double check. There we go. So, boom, hubcap, 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 hubcap. Yep, hubcap, hubcap, hubcap. All right, I think we're good. I think we have all the hubcaps now. Yep, we're fully capped. Nice. Open says me. Uh, let me in. Uh. Oh, we do have a sponge in here. Oh, there's a shovel, too, and a pair of aviators. Well, we could probably buff some of the less ruined hubcaps. Wait a minute. This one doesn't have hubcaps on the front. What the heck? 
Well, that's not good. Okay, I probably lost him in accidents, honestly. <laughs> but we have two more, so that's fine. Okay, there we go. And you are capped. All right. Pick you up, and we'll uh, do a little buff on here. Get this all... Uh, Kind of shined up. Come on, baby. Or not. That's cool. <laughs> it didn't work. That's enough autosave right now, bud. Come on, bud. That's enough. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. No, are you are you polished already? Is that is that your deal? Yeah, I think it might be. You can see the re the reflection in it. All right, well, this one is not. Come on. Are you gonna Are you gonna buff for me, bud? Oh yeah, there you go. That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. That one's good. This is becoming a problem. This one's good. That one's good. That one's good. Okay. Good. Not good. Here we go. Come on, just, just buff up. Nice. You can't buff that one, but we can buff this one. The other one won't buff with all the rust on it. You got to get a brush on that one. Yeah, and then this brush is over. All right, or this sponge is over. All right, cool. Let's get the heck out of here. Up and in, and there we go. All right, so the road's back over there. Let's continue on, continuing on. Oh God! Don't don't catch the building. Okay, we're good. All right. I think yeah, there's the road right there. So we'll just yeah follow it this way. Excellent. Beautiful. This is the way it should be. I'm hoping to find another Canadian tire because they always got lots of uh, cleaning supplies. But I see another building in the distance. We might be able to get to. So let's uh, proceed down the road here, ways. And see if that one comes into focus. Okay. I'm, I'm enjoying this thoroughly. Today's just one of those days where everything's going pretty good. I'm figuring things out. Things are getting better. Stuff's getting better every day. This is so good. So good. And you don't always get days like this in the game. If you've watched my series long enough, you'll know that uh, some days are far worse than others. But that's not the point. The point is that you got to make do with even the bad days for a good time. And uh, half of this game is watching it fall apart on you when all the stuff's going wrong. Oh, I'm so happy. This whole year has been good for me. And I know the world struggled a bit and it sucked and I get that. But the world's been good to me this year. A lot of things got into place that uh, I never expected to ever happen. And you guys made all that possible, so it's very much appreciated. Thank you for continuing to watch the ones that do and supporting my channel. You guys are the best. Like, the best. I have no words. None. Looks like we got a big garage coming up. Looks like we got a trailer on its side. Looks like we have spinning and flying trailers. Looks like we're going to have problems here any second. Yep, here we go. Please don't be all wrapped around each other. Okay, that's fine. We're good. Come on. Come on, baby. You got this. You know, just when I said everything was going great, now it's tipping over other trailers. Come on. Fix yourself. Oh, no, we're losing it all now. There it is. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, those two are back up. Now these two are on their sides. And nice. Okay, perfect. See, you just got to let them correct themselves. They'll get there. Oh, come on, baby. Where are we? 48. And not a thing in sight. Forty-eight, yeah, we're over forty-eight now. 
Mm, do we want to stop here? Yeah, we do. I also see something in the distance, so we're easily going to make our distance today. So we might as well see if there's a... What do you call that thing? A uh, brush here. We can polish up some of those rims. This one looks pretty clean. Okay, okay, we're, we're on the ground. We're stuck in the ground. We are stuck in the ground. Stuck, 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 stuck. Okay, come on. Oop, there we are. Love cowboy opens the door to freedom. What do we got? Diesel. Okay, well, we're definitely taking that. Here, have some diesel. Beautiful. All right. You just sit there for a sec while I close this back up. How much is left in you? 20 liters. That's enough. That's worth uh, putting in the tank. Okay. Done. All right. Oof. We got, oh, we got more sunglasses here. Man. We got a dangly poo. I remember when I had dangly poos for a while. Poop is definitely a very big theme of this game. Speaking of which. Oh, 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 yeah. <gasps> road lotion. Mwah. You've been a big help for me on this road, this long trip. Look at this crappy radiator. Jeez. Not much going on in here either. I got music boxes, though. Yeah, well. No sense in worrying about it. There's nothing much going on in there. And we're off. Now, I thought I saw something in the distance. Yeah, I do. It's a ways away, but I see something. Excellent. Okay. Gonna hit this 50 kilometer point right now. Gonna drive down my road and pretend I give a crap about the road itself. But I don't. I just want trailers to do trailer things. But da ba da ba da ba da. Uh. Yeah, that looks like might be. Maybe that's not something. Yeah, that's not something at all. Damn it. Looks like there's a ship out there. The frame rate is absolutely horrendous here for some reason. I don't know if it's my trailers or what, but the frame rate is definitely struggling real hard. Which is really weird because, like, normally it only struggles if there's a lot of physics items around. And the only physics items I have is the trailers, and it normally runs fine. Even with all the trailers. So I don't know what's going on, so I apologize, but... Yep, we'll just have to deal with it. One step at a time. Oh, oh, come on, baby. There you go, just relax. Now hopefully we can get around here without having another trailer explosion. Cactuses seem to really like making the trailers go nuts. Okay, well, we'll go on the other side of this tree. Yeah, there's definitely something over... Oh, it's a... Um... Yep, there it goes. There it goes. Yeah, I hit a cactus. That's what cactuses do to you. No, don't pull me backwards. I got places to be. Throttle up, throttle up. Come on, baby. Okay, let's just slow down for a second. They will release. And should I give them a manual release? I don't know. But they're definitely inside each other. Come on, baby. Don't, don't do this right now. We're just about at our goal. Nope. Nope. Yeah, okay, this is just yeah, this is this is gonna get dangerous here in a second. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. Oh god. <laughs> Alright, you guys do your thing. I'm just gonna wait here. 
Oh god, this this may not correct itself. Oh, there's there's some correction. Uh, we're now Harry Pottering. Okay. Hold on, love cowboy. Hold on, bud. Karen, hold on. This is getting really wild. This, in no way, oh, there's a headlight or a hubcap. Oh, yeah, like I'm going to find out which hubcap that belongs to. Oh, God. At some point, the game is going to crash or they're going to correct themselves. Oh, that one corrected itself. That one did too. The question is, will I be alive when it happens? Come on, baby. Perfect. Okay. Now, one of the hubcaps fell off. I'm not sure this whole mess is going to correct itself anytime soon. But it will fix itself. They always do. Come on. So we've definitely lost a hubcap somewhere uh, back there, but I'm not going to worry about it yet. Oh, yeah. Don't, don't you worry, trailers. You're coming with me no matter what. So don't act like it's not happening. Oh, was my hubcap. That's fine. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, not quite. Come on, baby. I see a little building over there we need to get to. All you got to do is wiggle around a bit. Oh, come on. You know you want to fix yourselves. You always do. That's the beauty of this game, is all the problems seem to correct themselves over time. We might have to run it into something to correct it. Alright, well, let's, uh... Let's have a sleep for a second and see if we can get it to go like that. Whoa, took for a while for the sound to kick in there. Okay, here we go. All right, what are we doing here? Let's bang you off this. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Don't tell me I can't fix stuff, but we need a new hubcap. We're missing one now. It's back there on the road. I saw it fly off. All right, see, you just got to put a little effort in and everything works itself out. Okay. It's a beautiful moment. Now, I did see... I thought I saw a little house, but maybe I was wrong. What's that? What is that? Ah, okay, let's go see what that is. We'll stop there. Wait a minute. Is that... No. What is this? What is this? Is this... Oh, I know what this is. This is one of those weird houses that they added that you don't catch very often. That, now I know what this is. Okay, I was like freaking out. I was like, is this my home? Yes, perfect. This is going to work. Sorry about that. I was getting a little confused. And where are we at anyway? Oh, God, I can't see. 53 and a half. Nice. Okay, we'll pull alongside this. Say right about here. We'll stop it here. Okay, that is good enough. All right, ignition off. What are we at? 53.6. We'll call it 53.5. All right. Excellent. So I'm going to leave this episode here, I think. 
Ooh, after the autosave. Sorry about all the trailer antics today. You know how it is. Uh, 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 there we go. Whoa, someone left her AK here. You know, I kind of like this little house, but I don't like how you can't access all the rooms. What, what is this? Oh, God. What? There's like all this sort of crap in the way. Like, this room is not connected. This room is not connected. I find that strange. But other than that, but yeah, I'm going to leave this episode here. Uh, yeah, so that's another episode done and dusted. We got something else coming up, but I don't know what it is. I guess we'll figure out that the next time we're in here. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this, please leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. Maybe tell your friends to subscribe. Maybe get your dog to subscribe. Maybe hit the little bell because you want some ringing in your life. And if you didn't like this, well, you should probably find yourself a real YouTuber because I am not much of one. Thank you so much for watching. Love every view I get. Cape Goat. Thank you for watching. This was a really, really weirdly excitable episode for my trailers. Out.